guys. So I'm back at it. Um, it is crazy windy today. It's a little bit miserable. The wind's not so bad down here in this canyon, but uh, I'm out finding a couple more locations. This location here is the Silver Plume. And I believe it was mined up until the 80s, believe it or not. Um, so obviously Forest Department has got a hold of this location and bat barred it all off as usual. Well, let's uh, let's go through these um, these shafts and whatnot, and uh, you know, see what we can see at least, guys. So what do we got on this first one? Big shaft going down in there. So huge stoped out section there. They obviously found a huge vein. I gotta say, sometimes it's disappointing when you hike your butt off and then you see this, you know, but. Not much you can do about the nanny state, I guess. All right, next one. Next one over here. Just a lot more stoked out areas. So another huge stoked out area too. They're just following this whole vein. With these stoped out sections here, I'm really wondering if we got something down here. You would think so. Okay. And one more section down here. I should have grabbed my pack and kept on going down. It's like incline shaft here, maybe to get to that, all these stoped out areas. That old gear. That's cool. <clears throat> huh. Wow. Look at this, guys. <laughs> Got some more carts. Ha <laughs> ha. An old mucker. Sweet. No way. Pretty sure that's what that is. An ore cart? No, they're two muckers. Oh, too bad we can't get into this one. Dang. Very cool. Gardner Denver. Made in the USA. Shoot, there's the serial number, the patent number. Can we get a close up of the serial number there? Maybe we can look that look that up, huh? Yeah. Air compressed muckers, I'm pretty sure. Lifts that material up, throws it in a cart. <clears throat> yeah, just lifts up the material, boom, right into a cart. Look at these rails. Look 
Going all the way out to where they're loading it, I guess, huh? Not sure what that was exactly. I already see a light on there. Maybe that was some type of ore cart. So we're out here. I brought uh, Brennan and his, his friend Jared out here to the Hickory is. So we we're looking for mines. Haven't had much luck finding anything today yet, but found this old homestead. Thought we'd stop and check it out. Kind of bad, huh? Yeah, right. Yeah, there's cat poop. Yeah, it's graffiti, said cat poop. And COVID 2020, that other cat poop. Watch your step. Wow, oh, where are you getting that roof? I wonder if there like, used to be a way to get the roof. Pretty cool. So this is the old town of uh, Hikaria right here. Um, just a couple of buildings, but um, definitely worth uh, checking out. Maybe an old feed storeroom here or something, huh? Nice old linoleum here. <laughs> Yo! Okay, hang on. Old wood stove probably sat there, huh? Yeah, I wonder what happened. They kept the canned goods underneath there to sell. Yeah. Sure does look like a little store, doesn't it? What's that red rock? Well, oh, yeah. we'll have to look up some old pictures of Hickory and see. Huh. Cool. This whole area, I believe, was a part of the Lucky Strike iron mines. <laughs> it looks like they got pretty lucky. Looks like we might have some more stuff over here. This one's barred off too. Uh, dang. That's oh, got a shaft going to the top. Hmm, right above it. You know, I got, I gotta say, I, I understand, I understand putting bars to, to keep people safe. I understand that. But at the same time, 
they're closing off history and you should be able to go to the forest department or something and take like a safety course or prior take like an M Shaw safety course or something and then you know get a key to these places and then be able to get in them tell them where you're at you know and then return the key just to film just to document you know because that's just that seems kind of crazy to me but um it is what it is you know the nanny state and everything but uh Well, let's just keep venturing up the road. Way up here, guys! Whew. Another cool shaft, though. Oh, that one looks like it doesn't go down very far, but then it turns underneath and heads that way. Looks like an air compressor pipe. I bet this one went way down, guys. Yeah, these are rock now. I can't hear you. Wait, 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 quiet, quiet. Everyone quiet. Here, quiet. Everyone quiet, quiet, quiet. There's the wood. The shaft is on this side. Wait, look at that white thing in the middle, dude. Yeah? Wow. Wow. Yeah, I can't see the bottom. Yeah, for real. Yeah, you can't even get your head in there. I could probably. See what, on these shafts, guys, this side would be your man way. So the guys would go up and down there, and then they bring up the material on this other side. Okay. Whoa! Echo! Echo! Very ah. cool timbering. Good afternoon, people. We just, uh, me and Sydney here. She's hiking with me today. Um, we just did a pretty decent hike. And uh, we saw this this adit from way over there. And then we were thinking, hey, looks like we can get into it. But uh, we got here and we cannot. A little something going down there. And then I shined a light in there, but it doesn't go very far, maybe 50 feet, and it pinches off. But yeah, so this whole whole big face right here, or portal, from way over there, <laughs> it looked like a huge portal. Yeah. So that's what really got me excited. But hey, like I said, you never know until you get here. Satellite images only show you so much. Let's hike up here and I'll show you guys this shaft going down to this one. What year is that? Looks pretty darn old. All right, here's the shaft that's obviously connected to that attic. All right, 
right guys, I hiked, hiked down to this one earlier and it's pretty easy. So I didn't even bring any gear. So I brought my gear this time. Let's see, where was this thing? Through here, I believe. Some pretty thick stuff up in here. A lot of cactuses. Uh, no, let's go around this way. Okay. This one looks extremely old. Okay, I think our addicts right here, I believe. Yeah, straight down here, man. Looks like a lot of ore. Yeah, it's right here. Look at this, guys. This has got to be old. I mean, like I said, it's not on any map whatsoever. Here, here's the edit right here, man. <laughs> you can see Dean up there. That may just be the shaft coming down on the top over here. Let me stop here. No crap oh, okay. This wind doesn't go down very far at all. No, nah, not at all. Yeah, I'm a... But check this out, though. Must have an old pulley or. It looks pretty old, huh? Sure is. Where's this go? Good question. Let's see. Yeah, it doesn't go really far. Just kind of opens up in a room here. No buried treasure in there. Just move into a room? Yeah, I just got a big room here. What do you think, guys? Should I walk over that or not? <laughs> It's just like a little platform or hmm. little section going that way, not very far. Yeah. And a section there. It pinches out back here. Oh, there's a nice stoked out area right here. Hmm. That's interesting. Maybe we can peek our head up in here and look. Hmm. 
you know, you can see the, uh, the sparkle and everything else they were going for here. I'm not sure what it is. That pinches out and that pinches out there too. Yeah. Face is out there. That's it, man. And so, you know, it's like a lot of these areas, it seems like they found a little something, started, started working real hard, and then it just phased out for a lot of this stuff. Right.